What's good YouTube, and for this edition of our NBA 2K22 tutorial, we're going to be discussing the different spin combos that you can execute in NBA 2K22. I'll be providing an in-depth tutorial on the different spin moves and the combinations you can execute, some new animations for NBA 2K22, and how best to combo them up with your other moves. These moves are great because they create a lot of confusion in your defender. They're also great because you can combine them with your launch animations in order to explode into a more aggressive move. And these moves are also great for creating a lot of space from your defender, which you can then exploit to attack. So before we get to the tutorial, I'd appreciate a sub if you haven't yet. And if these videos are helpful, a like would also help the channel out a lot. Alright, let's get started and as always, we'll start with the basics. To execute a spin dribble, rotate the right stick clockwise with the ball in your right hand and quickly release. And rotate the right stick counterclockwise with the ball in your left hand. To perform a cross spin dribble, just rotate the right stick clockwise with the ball in your left hand and counterclockwise if the ball is in your right hand. Make sure you release the right stick after you do your right stick rotation. To perform a half spin, rotate the right stick from right to up with the ball in your right hand and from left to up with the ball in your left hand. To perform a spin disengage HESI, hold the left stick in the direction of your right stick spin. So if I rotate my right stick counterclockwise, I want to be holding the left stick to the right. To perform a spin disengage step back, you want to hold the left stick away from the basket after your right stick rotation. Make sure to practice this at different spots of the floor because they activate differently. You can also perform your spin disengages using the cross spin. Your spin disengages have opportunities to branch out into an explosive launch. You could also combine this with your other right stick moves, just play around to see what works. New in NBA 2K22 is the ability to combine your spins with different crossover combinations. In order to perform your spin to crossover combos, flick the right stick to execute any crossover move towards the same direction of your right stick rotation. So if I'm spinning towards my right, I want to flick the right stick up into the right to perform a crossover, to the right to perform a between the legs cross, down into the right to perform a behind the back dribble, or down to execute one of these fancy crossover moves. You can also launch out of these crossover moves. Try to find out what combination works well and when you can explode to maximize the efficiency of the attack. To execute your spin crossover combos on the move, just make sure to let go of the left stick before your right stick input. Next is the Iverson Spin, and to perform the Iverson Spin, you want to be holding the left stick towards the opposite direction of your right stick rotation. Changing the timing of your left stick input will allow you to perform an Iverson Spin HESI into a crossover launch. Try playing around with the timing of the inputs in order to get these down consistently. You can also combine these moves with other shot gathers to create some devastating combinations. The last move in the spin variation series is the cross spin in and out. With the ball in your left hand, execute a cross spin by rotating the right stick clockwise and then immediately holding the left stick towards the right. CP3 so nice with it, he don't even need to look to the basket to shoot. Try playing around with the different combinations to get to different spots on the floor. You can also combine these with your other shot gathers and other dribble combinations after the animation. So hit me up in the comment section below if you're having trouble executing these moves and let me know what you think. 